Oh, Mr. Matt Carter. Come on, man. Okay, over here in charge of the drums, the Groove Meister. It's called Simon Lee. Fantastic Groove. Right over here in the brass corner. On trumpet and flugelhorn, yeah, man. I didn't even know you played two of them, man. Do you do them at the same time, man? <laughs> we have a Mr. The beautiful, the beautiful Matt Holland on trumpet and flugelhorn. Okay, we have the uh, Kayless Whisperer here, man, and then. Um, he enjoys himself at that moment, man, because it is a big moment. But, uh, on saxophone, Mr. Jimmy Anderson. Okay, we got the uh, we got the Cheeto Twins, man. The uh, Colombian drug dealers here, man. You know what I mean? It, it, it felt like a good idea in the dressing room to be of something like this, man. But uh, it's all about the music, right? So listen, um, this geezer here, uh, we go back a long, long way. Woo! Just I'll tell a story, right? Guys. In, in 1984, come here, come here. In 1984, when we were looking for a guitarist, was it 1884? I don't know. Man. Anyway, 1984, and um, Graham rocked up in his uh, orange marina, right? Woo! Mustard arena, uh, marina. And uh, he got out of the car and he and he had he had like a goatee and long hair. A, a wee bit the way I look now, man, you know what I mean? So he had that and he had a long green coat on and he had a Doctor Who scarf on and he took his arm, put the boot and I was like, this is never fucking gonna work man. Just, All right, come on in, we'll have a wee play in that. Then he played and the gig was his uh, and it's been He's, he was a new boy for 40 years, man, so listen, he's been here, and he's one of my oldest friends. Put your hands together for Mr. Graham Duffin. Great. Okay, man. I say something funny there, but there's nothing funny to say here, apart from the fact that we wouldn't be here, right? If it, if it wasn't for this guy here. So he came down, he came down to my house and uh, we went into the, we went into the, uh, <laughs> I really want to fucking say something here. But, uh, let's keep this a family show, man. And, uh, so we went into the wee back room, into the studio, played a couple of chords of Goodnight Girl and this guy sang the shit out of it and I mean sang the shit out of it. I was sitting behind him and he's singing and I'm playing the guitar and I'm getting shivers up my spine and I just thought he's the guy to take us forward. So if it wasn't for Kevin, we wouldn't be here today. So a massive, massive round of applause for Kevin. Come on, come on. Thank you, sir. I'm always joking. I'm always joking. This guy is the kindest guy I've ever met, I swear. Do you know what? In fact, I've been part of the group now for five years, and, and during that short space of time, he's become like a granddad to me. Um, <laughs> I mean, like a really young one. Really young. I mean, one of those, you know, that knocked someone up when they were 13. Anyway, um, anyway, anyway seriously. You're a legend, mate. I love you. You're a great friend. And uh, thanks for, for having me in this amazing gig. I absolutely love it. <laughs> You're having that, you fucking kick-ass bass player, man. Give a massive round of applause for Mr. Graham Clark! Hey!